Hey everyone, welcome to another unboxing at AMI. Um, today we're going to talk about the NMEA 2000 liquid level sensors from Veritron. Now Veritron have three sizes in this, it's a 200 to 600, a 600 to 1200 and a 1200 to 1500. That's in millimeters. For anyone that's in old school, you'll have to Google the change rate. We've got the 200 to 600 unit here. It comes with the unit. Lovely information pack. And a tank fitting kit. N2K. Everybody has plotters these days that, or MFDs that use N2K. Now, You've got a tank on your boat, you want to see what's in it. Uh, you've got to use a converter or such. This is a straight N2K sensor. This is the 200 to 600, as you can tell, it's nowhere near 1.2. Now how they change the length is quite simply, you release the two locking pins there, and then you change the length to suit. And as you can see, it's coming up at the top there. Once that's come up, you then cut it and make sure there's about 10 to 15 mil left between it and the bottom of the tank. Now, of course, you have to, once you've done that and you've plugged it in, you have to actually uh, adjust. There's a little adjustment screw here. There's information in the package about slow blinking and fast blinking. Once the once it's gone into the slow blinking and fast blinking stage, you actually set the, the lowest limit. And we'll show that when we turn on. Now what you also have here is that this unit isn't just set for one tank. You'll see here, there are some dip switch settings, okay? Those dip switch settings are two different lots. One lot is to say whether it's waste or water so you can use this for waste or water, so the system will get on its N2K message that it's waste or water. And then on the other one, it will give a tank number. And you can have tank one, two, three, or four, depending on the combination. Quite simple, you install it, comes with the uh, mounting kit, so you can thread it straight in. We go down, grab the N2K connection. Quite simply, into your backbone on your network, it will start flashing to show that it's on the network. Once it starts getting liquid past this level, it will stop flashing and it will start outputting to your system. It works in a percentage, so it's 0 to 100%, 100% full, 0% empty. Thanks for listening.